Welcome back to Wisconsin Family. We are filming here at the fabulous Gruno's Diamonds. This is a fabulous place. Oh my God, what a fantastic showroom. We're excited to show you more about Gruno's. They're finally here in Madison. Yes. And we're gonna talk to owner Brent Mead a little bit later, pick his brain. Right now, we're gonna talk to you about Pegasus Games. So Pegasus Games actually started many, many years ago on State Street, I understand, in a converted house years and years ago. Now a staple of Madison, so <laughs> good so to know. cool. Yeah, and Lori, I'm excited to talk to you. So tell us, we're going to pick your brain a little bit. Okay. Welcome, first of all, to the show. Thank you. And tell us a little bit, just for folks at home, if they haven't heard of Pegasus, give us a little background. What do you have to offer the average Wisconsin family? Well, we sell games that are not something you probably grew up with. Um, games have evolved, just like everything else, and mm -hmm. now they can be um, challenging, they can be mindless if that's what you want. Um, they, can be, yes. they can be beautiful artwork, um, but most of the games we carry are going to be things that will be fun and challenging, make you think, and entertain you all at the same time. Okay, so we can choose to think or not think. We Correct. The option. Okay, yeah. I like that. <laughs> yeah. I like that. <laughs> so speaking of thinking now, um, do you sell, uh, are, are, are they all educational games that you sell? Mm. They are not. We, we try to stock games that are mostly designed to have a really sound game mechanic. The way the game works and the rules are all interesting. These are way beyond roll the die and move your piece on a board. Um, so they will teach things like uh, social skills, taking turns, being a graceful loser if necessary. <laughs> um, they will also teach you strategic thinking and you know just how to organize things to win. And if you didn't win this time, think about it, you might win next time. And there's some, some, there's some great things, uh, great opportunities for people to kind of create really rich storylines to go with some of these games as well. Yes, hmm. especially the role-playing games and yes. some of the tabletop miniatures games. You yeah. can create as much backstory for the character or the army that you are fielding at any given time. Yes, wow. very cool. Yeah, lots of different things going on. And you mentioned a little bit about kind of teaching some skills and getting some things. So I'm kind of thinking children. I just had my own. She's not probably quite ready to probably play not. a game yet. Four weeks old, <laughs> but, months, yeah. but we'll get there, <laughs> yeah. right? So do you have mostly games for children or kind of tell us about the variety? No, uh, most of our games are probably for age eight and up. Okay. We do carry a selection of what I call games that adults can stand. Okay. Um, so they're going to be engaging for adults. Um, I mean, some of the games that are in our kids section are played exclusively by adult, by adult groups okay. also. Um, so they're, again, they're sound games, they're mm -hmm. fun, they're challenging, but a lot, they don't always need to be so complicated that a younger player could so play So the parents them. can play with their kids and have some fun. Exactly. Yeah. That's face good. to face time. That's, yes. That's yes. good. That's great. So, you know, one of the things that I think is really kind of cool about Pegasus is that, you know, uh, it's not a, a business that just closes its doors at five o'clock. You have stuff that's going on every single day where people are coming in to play the games that you sell. Can you talk to us about some of the, the games that are played in your store? Sure. Mm -hmm. We have games that really kind of need a, a large group of people and not everybody has room in their home to do that. Um, so we have uh, Magic the Gathering, which is a very popular card game, played twice a week at least, sometimes more often. Um, we have Dungeons and Dragons and other role-playing games that uh, people need to get together to play. Um, we also have uh, the tabletop miniature games, which are featured in some of our other ads. And uh, for that, we have a whole, a whole room full of little buildings and roads and hills and things to set up terrain so it looks like you're actually playing you know, recreating a battle on a, on a field. Um, we also have two days of just general board games. Um, you can play classics. A lot of the times the players like to play things that are brand new and see what they're like. Right. Wow, Absolutely. there's a lot There's a lot to offer. Right. So great for a rainy day or, you know, if you're just somebody who likes it, to do gaming or you got a big family, all it's, kinds of and things it's to a, offer. It's an affordable alternative to going out. You know, you Absolutely. pay for the game once, you can play it multiple times. And for folks who are watching at home who maybe haven't come to see you yet, mm -hmm. they will now, right? I hope. Um, <laughs> tell us a little bit more. How can they get more information? Where can they find you? Well, we are on the web at PegasusGames.com. We have a Facebook page also called Pegasus Games. Um, and that would be the best way to find us. Fantastic. And for somebody who's new, I mean, if you're if you're not in, haven't done a lot of these games mm -hmm. and haven't been in, how... Um, 
is it overwhelming to kind of come in and be there for the first time? Do you kind of help folks walk them through the store? Oh, it we're, sounds like there's just a do, lot. Do, they get, do, do beginners get dirty looks when they walk in? Like, yeah. who's this? Am I guy? welcome? I don't <laughs> Absolutely know not. We love, to introduce, we love to introduce people to this okay. hobby. We, everyone who works for us um, loves gaming, um, thinks the world would be a better place with more gaming. Um, and one of the things we also kind of like to guide people to is games that are designed by people here in Wisconsin. We really? have a lot of very talented game designers here in, in Wisconsin, and um, we'll show you some of those um, in a little bit. How neat is that? It's all, keep it here local, right? Yes, indeed. Yeah. Well, go see Lori Aiken over at Pegasus Games. You know, Father's Day is right around the corner, you know, being a dad. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And uh, I'm sure gifts. you have a dad. <laughs> we have, and, and we actually uh, see a, a big sort of uptick in some of our games and chess sets. Fabulous. For Father's Day. So great Father's Day gifts. And actually, after the break, we've got Greenway Station here. They're going to walk us through a great selection of gifts for Dad. It's all right here on Wisconsin Family. We're here at Gruno's Diamonds. Stick around. Thanks, Lori. Thank you.